Homelessness is not an easy thing to understand. What the experience feels like, why our society lets it happen, and what we can do to end it. In March 2021, we were given the opportunity to develop a higher education online course that would take up the challenge of trying to explain why homelessness, something that often seems so simple, is actually rather complex. This is the story of how understanding homelessness in Canada, from the street to the classroom, came to be and where it is going next. We decided that using press books, an open ebook format would provide us with the most flexibility. The course is interdisciplinary, examining homelessness from a range of perspectives. This way, instructors can use the resource in its entirety to teach a course about homelessness, or they could adopt individual sections as modules. Three months into the project, we had reviewed the literature, identified 10 disciplines to include, and come up with a set of three questions for each. We were on a roll. But the decision we made next changed the course of the entire project. We plan to reach out to colleagues, academic researchers at universities throughout Canada, and ask for advice on what we should include. Then it hit us. What if we met over Zoom, filmed these conversations, and included them as videos in the resource? If we did that, students could hear from these researchers firsthand. We cast a wide net, hoping that just five people would say yes. We watched our inboxes with wonder as five researchers agreed, then 10, then 15, until we had 26 of Canada's leading homelessness researchers in line to record conversations with us. We set about conducting interviews in pairs, with one expert with lived experience of homelessness and one academic expert from our team in each. In total, 271 video clips were embedded throughout the resource, along with video descriptions, closed captions, and written keynotes for each. These videos are all publicly available on YouTube. As our team worked to develop this resource and the videos, we had yet another idea. Why not take these videos and combine them into a podcast series for auditory learners? Yes, indeed. All 271 video clips were enhanced and combined, resulting in 35 podcast episodes in total. We integrated a range of interactive and engaging components, such as flip cards with quotes and an art gallery from people with lived experiences of homelessness. We also created a series of non-identifying real-life case studies to put a face to people's experiences of homelessness and to provide discussion prompts for groups of learners. In just over one year since its launch, this resource has been accessed through Pressbooks over 55,000 times by nearly 16,000 unique readers. On YouTube, the videos have been watched 8,425 times from viewers in Canada, the United States, Tanzania, Kenya, and Brazil. Student response to the resource as an online course has been unequivocal. Understanding homelessness in Canada was identified as one of Pressbooks community favorites, named Book of the Month, and won the award for excellence in online and blended learning innovation from the Online Learning Consortium. In just over two years, this project transformed from humble beginnings with the plan to create an online course and our hopes that five people would talk to us to an internationally awarded learning innovation. We did not set out to win awards, but to help people better understand homelessness as a step towards solving it. Understanding homelessness is difficult knowledge, that which is not easy to learn about, but that which we as a society and individuals cannot ignore. The overwhelmingly positive response we have received with this resource has compelled us to develop a new hope, a less humble hope. We want to share this resource around the world with as many learners inside and outside of the classroom as we can. With every award and recognition that we receive, we push that hope a little farther. Our ultimate goal is that understanding homelessness in Canada will help us better understand homelessness around the world.